these are mosaics and I made the, mine out of eggshells but a lot of people they use tile this is what one that my sister Rosie made and this is one that I made and you could use glass and, and you glue it onto another piece of glass. If you have an old bowl that's real special, this was real special and it broke. So first you glue, see that, see where it's cracked? See, I glued that and then I got some little tiles and I glued them on there. And then this is gonna, good to go and then uh, we put bird seed in it and put it outside and the birds come and eat. I like this yes. one. Well, you know what these are? Do you know what that is? What? These are, yeah, you're right. Egg little, picture frames. They're picture frames. You see, these are all <laughs> eggshells. You can glue those on the wood, but you have to be real careful because if you just glue them on, they're gonna come off. And so we have to have your mom varnish it. And that's what I did. If you don't have cardboard, you can go to the Goodwill and you can get old board games and then just glue it on back of that. And this is, <laughs> The butterfly one. Do you like that one? That's like a Mexican tile. Another but one. A part. A part. <laughs> well, see, this was the other half. All over the world, people are saying prayers because this is the World Connectedness Day, and that's when everyone thinks about that we're all connected. I and I thought, what a good idea to have a mosaic to show that we can make pretty things out of broken things. See how all the different colors are? Do you see the different colors? Oh, look at that. All right, these are for cake decorating. But the best kind of um, colors that I've used are the Easter egg one, ones, but since it's out of season, we have to use cake decorating. We're gonna add water. Everyone will get some water. And you have a spoon. Ooh, that's a pretty color. It's light green. This is supposed to be very hot water. And then you just squeeze enough of this food coloring. Oh, this is purple. Favorite. Do you want purple? You put orange. Okay, that's perfect. And the directions say to add just a little bit of vinegar. The vinegar is just to set the color. I want everybody to have different colors. So you can see what it looks like when it's the white eggs or the brown eggs. And even the brown eggs have different colors. Look at this. Now put them in, and then with your spoon, you're gonna just like, I want you to bathe the egg shell and just take the spoon and just kind of, but don't be afraid of the water. For our project, the best thing is to have a, a really bright, pretty colored okay, board. Done. Would you like a heart or a flower? I want a heart. I want a heart. A heart? Okay. I'm just going to draw it for you. I'm, I would like a star. I had a feeling you would say that. I don't know why. How many of you on a rainy day you feel like you want to draw more. It just, it does something to the creativity. You just, you come alive almost when it's dark and rainy. At least I do. This is the glue and everyone is going to get some glue. But with this kind of glue, we don't need too much. shell see how it's curved you don't want to put it like that and then smash it we're gonna just say break it in little pieces like this not too you know and then with I always use this part of my finger and just kind of go down and I actually I use a long long needle but I don't know where it is right now so we're we're going to do this do you see how I, it's important to separate them I like to work in a little area instead of do the whole thing. You just a little by little. I'm gonna put my coins. I'm putting mine pink. Oh yes. She went over the line a little bit. You just break it with your because they're eggshells. Oh cool, that just came off. So you just go like that. That is so pretty.
Dylan's doing something that I forgot to point out. See how close the color is to his background paper? Dylan, you probably want to do a color that's a little bit brighter. Or like do a yellow. Or pink. Pink, pink works. Did you like this? Yeah. With the eggshells, isn't that? But what isn't it amazing that we have all these different colors and that see they were all broken in little pieces and with just a little bit of paper and your imagination and glue, we combined it and to, you make we made beautiful art. Let's this this is mine. Now, if I had more time, I would have went around the background with a solid color that's different than this, like maybe even a black, that would be really neat. Yeah. Or white would be neat. Let's, let's start, let's go, let's start with you. Um, when the flower grows in the garden, um, um you gotta give it water. Yes. And then, but, then, then it grows food and food ingredients <laughs> that, that you, you can mix together. And you know what, you have the word love in pink on your board. And lo everything that require that grows requires love. Everything. Yeah, because yeah, it still has like like a soul. It still does. You could actually, when you get home, but for the other kids who are watching, you can glue a string, two strings like here, or a pretty ribbon, and you can hang it over your door. The heart makes the one glow. So the love. <laughs> Love makes everything but grow. Makes this grow really fast. Then these eggshells. You're so good. You're all so all good. All the flowers. There are all flowers. There's green flowers. There's orange flowers. There's pink flowers. And there's blue. Perry, um, he he's really cut because he don't like the stars in the moon, so he's running away, so so he could never see. So he's going to outer space, so he won't, so he won't see the stars in the moon. That's neat. I, you know what I like? I like that you made a pink star. Do you do you girls like his pink star? Yeah. Because a lot of times people, star. it's a rainbow. Ooh, a rainbow star. That's beautiful. So, so many times we think that a star has to be a certain color and it really doesn't. Sometimes, you know, if you look at the eggshells, this is really true, and you just kind of go like this and let the light play on it, it really does look like they're made out of ceramic tiles. The shading is so subtle. In honor of September the 9th, 2009, this is World Connectedness Day. So right now, for just one second, let's hold our hearts together and we're just going to all connect. That's all you have to do. You're done. Say yay. Yay! Yay! Thank you for coming.